All right, it looks like the last thing that we have to add is the lyrics. So let's take a look at adding the lyrics. So I found a website that has the lyrics here. So I just command C to copy those. It's the Windows sign C on the PCs, I believe control C. Or on the Mac, it's the, the Windows C. And on the PC, it's the control C. And then I'm going to go back in here and I'm going to create a text box for my paragraph. I'm move this down here where I can see it. And then edit text. Highlight that. Hit command V. There's all my text. Uh, the only thing is I really don't want this uh, highlight behind it that it came in with. So I'm going to highlight it and then go over here to this one. And then sit, hit no color. There, that took my highlight off. So now I can grab this and bring this over here. And I'll need, uh, obviously, a title that says lyrics. And obviously, to get to stand out a little bit more, I think we need to probably, probably need to make that bold. Let's go ahead and make that bold, if it will, so it stands out better. And maybe italics. I don't know. I'm going to go with that for now. Now I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to add one more piece of text. I'm going to add a title. Put that over here. And I'm going to call that lyrics to the song or song lyrics would work too I suppose you get a little spacing between that move that in right to there and then try to keep the spacing about the same listen to the song here song lyrics and I'm just going to go ahead and just to make it match, I'm going to insert a line right there. Kind of just caps it off. I believe at this point, I'm going to hit save, save my work. I believe at this point, we have everything that the assignment calls for. So if we go back and look at the assignment sheet, um, I don't have all of my paragraphs in there yet. I have three of my paragraphs. There's two that we still need to write. I have a link to the audio of the song. Um, I have an image of at least one image. I have a link to the biography about Francis Scott Key. I have a link to a website that explains the Battle of Fort McHenry. I have a link to the lyrics, or actually I have the lyrics uh, pasted in there. So right now, according to everything that it asks for, it looks like my website is done. So I'm just going to look at this real quick in preview. This is what it looks like in preview mode. If I click here, this is what it would look like on a cell phone or a mobile device. So you can see even on my cell phone or my mobile device, it's going to look fine. Um, just one thing I want to clean up. Down here at the bottom, my footer. I'm going to go ahead and, and just make that a solid black. I think that would look better than having it white down there. There, now that, oops, I forgot to hit OK. I think I would have learned that from the other video. OK, OK, there. That just kind of cleans up the bottom of it. And then so all I need to do is after I finish writing my next two paragraphs, I'll just drop the intro in at the top, the conclusion at the bottom, and my website will be done. Now just to double check, if you want to know what your grade should be, if you look at this on here, is it missing? Partially meets the expectation, meets or exceeds the expectation. I went down through this, I created the account, I built the website, I included the text, I need the two more paragraphs for it to be complete, I have a link to the audio, I have an image, I have a link to the biography, a link to the event, and the lyrics. So if I were to add this all up after I put my next two paragraphs in, I would know I have everything and I would have an A. So that way you automatically know where you stand. And if I get a chance, I'll make another video that shows how you can take this now and start adding some extras because there are, this is a basic website, but there are a lot of uh, extra things you can add to it to kind of kick it up a notch.